kuat dalam perlawanan dan tersebut Baik, kita lupakan tentang game tersebut Fokusnya adalah perlawanan ini Yang kita mengharapkan sentuhan sentuhan yang ajaib Dan juga berkesan dari kapten kita Iaitu Badur Bakhtia And then second half, they defended resolutely The long ball's worth the chase here. It's a difficult one for the defender. Japan have a big chance here. Oh, he might uh, have to pick himself in a good position there. And this is this is for the occasions now. That's a penalty. That's a penalty. There's one. That is a penalty. There's two. That's three. <laughs> so <laughs> he's got the hamstring as the referee. See, <laughs> they're they're very very good players. You see in Honda at AC Milan. Agawa as well, so they, they do produce and go on and play in the in the top leagues in Europe. Play some lovely football to begin with here. They're really taking the game to Malaysia. It's a swirling shot and it's over the top from Iwasaki. He's done really well, isn't he? Very bright, very lively. There's going to be loads of gaps. I think you can see why Japan have scored early goals in their previous matches. Oh, they might concede one now. The ball has got through. He's one on one. He's one on two. He might be one on four in a moment. And that's uh, in row Z. Gets right underneath the final efforts. Does so happy. Good counter attack and play there. Europeans to just assess the strength of the Asian continent. Could have let that go through as it happens, and uh, there'll be a shot and a save and a follow up. The ball is uh, still just eluding in terms of a goal as yet. It breaks uh, for Malaysia's benefit, and then for Japan, he's slipping him through here. The flag has stayed down. It is Maeda. He's got to get the shot away. Deary me, soars over the crossbar. What an opening it was for Maeda. He's in two minds whether to pass it or whether to shoot. Takes it on himself. Onside. Should have scored. That was a great run from him. Cuts inside beautifully. But that's a really, really poor finish from him. Japan just edging possession. 58-42. And uh, onside here and in the area. Big shooting opportunity. Good save. Spreads himself well. Gets down to his left. Nadsley to foil the opponent. And, uh, well, that's nice. There's a... Uh, Japan are just starting to edge it territorially. And this is another good move, and an inviting ball here. Well, it was an inviting ball. It slithered right through that six-yard area without Maeda able to get a touch, and now the whistle is going to go. Despite the fact that Japan are in the ascendancy there, they've got a player down in. I think they've done enough with the possession that they've had. He's done well to keep that in. It was hammered at him, and I thought he was uh, going to lose the possession, but he's managed to keep it going. Here's another chance. He's offside, Maeda. I've just said he's getting in more, isn't he? He's got to finish one of these. Two oh, more chances. So that's a really, really positive run. Maeda, he uh, hit one way over the top, the curling sort of an effort from him. Very little for uh, Malaysia to boast about, but the goalkeeper's done okay for them. And that's to be on the end of something now. And there are plenty forward here for Japan, but fortunately for Malaysia, there's one defender back there, and that's all they need. That was a Dominic Tan, and the crowd's beginning to roar here. The sense that Malaysia, on a counter-attack, may even take the lead. They won't quite. It's almost just about the first shot they've had. It came in from Sawafi. A little better, a little spell this for Malaysia. And he drags himself clear. Three forward here. Is he going to have a go? He is. It's wide. But they've had two shots in two minutes now. The latest one. This from Rashid. Miles better played. And now we're on the clock and no goals. Uh, most people would have thought we'd have had something by now. And it's Malaysia who will look again. And the crowd is roaring for the third time in this half. Because he's through the six-yard area. We've seen that at both the with both. Well, the game has opened up a little bit for Malaysia's advantage. This is a good ball in. Shame, actually, it's funny, it wasn't even an attempt on goal, I don't think, but the ball nearly found its way through. I don't mind, I don't mind that a good early ball. 
Inevitably, Malaysia have everybody back behind the ball. Just probing footballers. Now they just put a bit of pep into it. Still here. And keeper spills it. And another chance. Well, I think if we do get a goal, it's probably going to be a scrappy one. Uh, the keeper there wasn't too sure about his whereabouts, I don't think. Yeah, just a great change of pace. Brilliant ball across. Trading the little short passes. It's an incisive one that's required. And Maeda might turn, and there will be a shot, and there will be a save. That's equal to it. The final effort got a shot from Sugiyoka. Oh, and it is Ueda who replaces Maeda. The ball angled back and then across, and a shooting chance here. It dribbled harmlessly into the arms of Nadsley. The goods inside the 90 minutes, and it's Malaysia's attack this time. Don't go offside, he's managed to stay onside. Here is their opportunity, straight through, and Japan have managed to cover their tracks for the time being. Keeper might be in trouble here. That's wide. Well, big roars from the crowd. Two big chances for Malaysia to snatch it. The young Tigers were, were all in there hunting. The ball across wasn't bad. Credit Japan with getting enough bodies around. They got rid of the. Keeping their shape well. Encouraging a forward run here. Free kick for Malaysia as well. Needless free kick conceded by the captain Itakura. And yellow card for him. It's one apiece in terms of cards now. That's a good change of pace. Salafi again. Good stretch, good keeping. It was dipping in. Great strike. And an idea in his head. That's a top. If you analyse the second half, the funny thing is Malaysia probably had the better chances. They might have another one yet. And ploughs on into the area. Oh, whisked through that six yard box. The keeper's trying to get a touch on it. And almost the hero of the night, Rizal Ghazali. Get a touch on it. We're really on the march in a minute, off the upright. Well, it's Malaysia suddenly who are carrying the fight to Japan. And it's... Well, I think it went the wrong way, but it might be all right now. Well, there's been more entertainment in the last five or six minutes. Five will take place at the start of next month. Here they come with uh, just over two minutes left he's got into the penalty area here oh it's a penalty kick it had to be a penalty kick the defender Dominic Tan is the one who was taken down the Japanese player inside the penalty area the referee had no hesitation correct call for me 100% all the question what card he shows him as well because he's definitely going to get a card sure be a, a, yet a young goalkeeper well Ueda won the penalty Ueda will take the penalty, will Ueda score the penalty? And we are in the last minute of the 90. Big, big moment for Ueda! Japan lead! He won the penalty, he scores it, and that may just be good enough. Japan have taken all night to find a goal, but they found it at the most precious moment of all. They do, they have. It's an emphatic penalty. Uh, word are you advisedly Ueda there won a penalty in the 90th minute and he smashed it home beyond the goalkeeper Nadsley so disappointment is massive for Malaysia they've given it absolutely everything but they've finally come to the end of the